Hello friends, this is my first video ever posted in YouTube for academic purpose. Here I will be uh, describing you a very interesting problem of Stokes theorem where uh, uh, the, the in-depth understanding of Stokes theorem is required to reduce your calculation. Okay, so let's see the problem first. Uh, here you are given uh, to find uh, curl V uh, ds means integral over curl of a vector uh, over a surface. Uh, vector is uh, as you can see uh, 4y uh, i cap plus x j cap plus 2z k cap. The surface is uh, a hemisphere x square plus y square plus z square equals to a square where z is greater equals to 0. Uh, I am uh, writing in the answer first. Answer is, will be minus 3 pi square. And as you uh, as you can see here that uh, I have written uh, this problem can be solved by 3 line calculation in just 30 seconds. And if you are doing long calculation then you don't know the trick. So here in this video I am uh, telling you the trick in depth with uh, understanding. First of all, uh, what you can do here? You are given a vector, you are given a surface. You can, you want to find a curl of that vector over the surface. Your uh, general understanding uh, says that you need to integrate over the hemisphere. You need to integrate the curl and doing the surface integral over the hemisphere. Are you doing that? Of course you can do. You can apply the Stokes theorem as you understand uh, now. Uh, that you apply uh, the curl, you don't uh, need to do the curl, you just apply Stokes theorem, calculate the line integral of this vector over uh, the line, over the base of the hemisphere. Uh, right, so you have two options right now in your mind. You are given the vector, you can find the curl, do the surface integral over that hemisphere, for that you need to find the uh, gradient uh, of that uh, surface and blah blah blah. Uh, then uh, other, either, other way you can find the line integral directly or uh, directly take the vector uh, V as given do a dr uh, over the base in that circle of the hemisphere will be the circle x square plus y square equals to square. So um, then uh, you do the line integral. Uh, in any case, uh, both the method is lengthy. You don't need that at all. You don't need that, okay. <laughs> Believe me, you don't need that. Hmm. Look, uh, in the green, uh, in the blue, blue uh, font. Uh, when the surface is open, we can integrate over either the open or the closed surface. Okay, we will go to the next slide and make you understand. Now, uh, now coming to the solution of the problem. First, uh, I should uh, tell you the statement of the Stokes theorem very, very clearly. Well, you have a vector. You are uh, evaluating the line integral of the vector around a closed curve. So look at the statement uh, written in the top uh, right corner. So you have a vector evaluating line integral of the vector around a closed curve. Well, this line integral should be equal to surface integral of the curl of the vector. Surface integral of the curl of the vector. But on which surface? Which surface? The answer is uh, around any surface which the curve binds. So the line integral of a vector uh, around a closed curve sigma around a closed curve should be uh, any uh, equal to any surface should be equal to the surface integral of that vector on any surface which the curve binds did not get the point. Huh? Okay, uh, look at the image. You have a hemisphere which is of course an open surface binded by the circle 
the dashed blue circle so your surface one is your open surface which is a hemisphere now uh, you look at the disk you look at the disk uh, binded by that circle on the xy plane the circle is on the xy plane of course the hemisphere is above the xy plane uh, and the disk is on the uh, xy plane disk is on xy plane binded by the circle so this is your surface 2 the closed surface which is the base of the hemisphere so uh, right now uh, can you imagine the two surfaces properly one is the open hemisphere two is that uh, closed surface the closed disk both are binded by the same dashed blue circle well the stokes theorem says that the line integral around a closed curve is same over any surface integral bounded by that curve i have already told you so now mm, uh, you are you have to you have to evaluate you have to evaluate the surface integral of the given vector surface integral of the given vector around the hemisphere uh, so this should be equal to the line integral uh, of uh, that vector around the curve uh, closed curve which is your dashed blue circle so by the use of the same stokes theorem the line integral of the uh, line integral of the vector around this dashed blue circle should be same as uh, the surface integral of the vector around the disk well surprised you should not be you should not be surprised the surface integral of V means curl V uh, dot ds over the hemisphere should be the same as curl V dot ds of the disk just because both the hemisphere and the disk is binded by the same dashed blue circle means line integral is the same V dot dr around the dashed blue circle is the same and the both the surfaces uh, is binded by the same dashed blue curve so the curl of v ds on uh, open hemisphere should be equals to curl of v ds on the disk so, so calculating the surface integral around the disk is very easy surface to the disk uh, in the xy plane n cap is k uh, of course uh, and the curl v we can already calculate you can calculate you, uh, you have the vector v curl v is minus 3k so curl v dot n is just minus 3 and the surface area of the disk is just simply pi r square pi s square uh, so you just uh, minus uh, 3 over d sigma surface integral is just nothing but minus 3 pi square well tricky isn't it <laughs> there are lots of tricks and lots of concepts are hidden in the world of physics so here I finish my first video uh, and uh, I promise you to give more interesting interesting videos uh, and I request you to please 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 uh, subscribe to my channel and if you like the video, of course, you share with your friends uh, freely, no problem. Uh, subscribe to my channel to get the regular updated. Uh, whenever I will uh, do a new upload, you will be notified if you subscribe. So please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching this video.